Welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm attempting the starting room challenge on Black Ops 3, Nactor and Torton. I'll be following a few rules while doing this challenge that I'll show on screen now. As I'm playing on Nactor and Torton, I have no access to Quick Revive as it can only be obtained by the Wonderfizz. So I have one life and one down is the end of the challenge. So without further ado, let's begin. The game starts and I immediately hit the gobblegum machine and luckily I roll in plain sight, which is the best gobblegum at my disposal. I make quick work of round one and when it ends, I buy the RK5. I also have enough points for the Shiva, but I don't buy that until later since I had the idea to save up for mule kick so I would have access to a third weapon slot. During round 3, I get an insta-kill from the first zombie I kill. This insta-kill aids me in finishing the round as quickly as possible. Also, off topic, I hope you find this new form of content interesting, as I'll be sprinkling in a few challenge videos with the normal content. So, if you're enjoying this so far, please consider subscribing and checking out my other content. Now, let's get back to the chaos. Round 4 is when the game actually starts, as the zombies get into the map decently fast meaning I don't need to wait an eternity for the round to be over. Near the end of a round, a zombie drops a nuke. I pick it up, ending the round, giving me enough time and points to purchase both Mule Kick and the Shiva. On round 5, I made a really bad error, which could have ended my game. While training, I misjudged the horde and thought I could fit through the pillar, but I was completely wrong. But before dying, I was able to pop in plain sight, so I survived. Nothing else interesting really happened until the middle to end of round 6 when I got a death machine which melted most of the remaining zombies on the round, only leaving a few which I picked off after the death machine wore off. And then finally round 7, I made a terrible mistake. I started a mini train going but while training I got caught on a little table beside me so I couldn't move. I tried to move forward but I just get triple swiped by a zombie. I try and pop in plain sights but for some reason it doesn't pop until I'm down even though in the same situation on round 5 I was immune while activating the gum but nevertheless this stupid decision and lack of a working gobblegum ended the run on round 7 which I'm not proud of but I'll have to take it so with that down ending the challenge it also means it's now the end of the video I hope you enjoyed this style of content if you did please comment down below more challenges I should do on Nacked and don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one